Welcome back to our Two Minute Tuesdays with Trish and Pastor Dave. <laughs> two minute, two, two, two. All right, today's question is from Byron. Is that how you say his name? Byron? <laughs> yeah, that looks like Byron. Byron right. D. Hi, All Byron. All right. He says, Dave. I know Sunny D. Sunny D. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Byron D might <laughs> be related. I don't know, but That's he'd be pretty joke. wealthy then. So it's, it's a dad joke. It's a, it's a pastor dad joke. Yes. <laughs> all right. He asked. Oof. All right. You ready for this? Okay. I'm scared now. <laughs> I'm a little scared too. All right. Okay. What is the meaning of life? <laughs> Why are we doing this at all? In two minutes. Oof. Oh my God. In two minutes, Pirate <laughs> I'd rather chug an entire thing Sunny of Sunny D. D. All, right. All right. Start your clock and pray. All right. The meaning of life. None of us know it. I mean, I can't answer that for you any more than you can answer that for me or the world. Holy but here's sucks. the thing. I mean, what are we really asking here? When we ask about the meaning of life, we're kind of asking, well, how do I connect to this? What is my purpose in the midst of this? Who am I in the midst of this? And you know what? Those are also infinitely huge questions that we can't answer even for ourselves, let alone for you. Mm -hmm. But we do know this, that the how of how we connect or where we connect is just mm -hmm. as important as the what we connect to. I mean, you and I do a billion things. I am a pastor, I am a dad, I am a consumer. I mean, you have been a college student, you've been a videographer, you've been a Dave Wrangler, you've done <laughs> a thousand things, right? And you will do a thousand more. But how you do them, for whom you do them, this reveals the meaning and the purpose. And the one thing that's clear as we go along every step of the way through scripture and through life is that we are meant to do these things with love. Mm. That we do not exist just for ourselves or to ourselves. That not everything in the world is meant for the sake of me. Rather, I am meant for the sake of the world and the people around me. And when I connect, in a way that is loving and together with the people around me, suddenly that meaning and purpose either becomes clear or we don't worry about it so much. Mm -hmm. It's when we're feeling isolated, alone, disconnected that we start to really fear about these things. And I suggest when we do that, find somebody to care about, love, do something for, and all of a sudden avenues will open up for you and for the world to connect together again. All right. Well. Thanks for that deep question. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Byron. I, I appreciate you. I was not you. prepared for that. I think I'm going to come to your door at like 4 a.m. and say two trains are leaving Pittsburgh and Cincinnati and going opposite. Okay. <laughs> Let's right. see how you answer, buddy. <laughs> well, if you have your own questions. And we do like them. You can ask questions. We do like love these. Fun. I was yeah. just very uh, unprepared it's, it's, for it's that. It's a big one, yes. Well, let's uh, smack you on a Tuesday afternoon. What's the meaning of life? Come on. Come on, Pastor Boy. 120 seconds. Let's go. <laughs> well, if you have your own questions, we have a forum at lightofthespirit.church and his email. Pastor at sov-id.org. And a Twitter. At Dave Deckard, D-E-C-K-A-R-D. Mm. Like Byron D. <laughs> and D, D meaning of life. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We will see you next week for our next video. <laughs> Bye. Why did I do that? <laughs> <laughs>